What's going on, everyone? Welcome to Trading Crypto. Today, we're going over Bath up 54% at 10 cents. So, let's get into the price prediction and technical analysis of math. So, this is pretty much exactly what we were talking about in the last update of math, but this was a lot larger than I expected. I was saying, let's watch out for that capitulation large run up, and this was a huge capitulation due to BTC. And you guys absolutely took off after that, approximately 170%. So, congrats to whoever's held. From there, so as of right now, let's draw some fibs and dissect this thing. So we're on the one hour chart, and then we're gonna look at the four hour chart. On the top right here, you can see we broke below the 0.5, currently working our way towards the 618 at about 0.9. MACD is still bearish, RSI is still overbought, and we did print a sell signal on the WTX. So let's be looking for a drop down to around the 618 area. Eventually, though, I think this thing's gonna start retracing back down to the main support at around 0.8 right here. So this is the price I'm gonna be keeping an eye on. For math and then we'll have to assess the situation at that time there is a 786 down here you see usually when we have these run-ups we do retrace back to where we were and we start that lull back down so is this different it could be but history doesn't repeat but it does rhyme so let's look watch out for that retracement from here and consolidation until the next run up because it looks like all this thing does is pump consolidate capitulate pump consolidate capitulate so let's look at the four hour chart and see what's going on there Similar to the one hour chart, we're still getting held up at the 0.5. We do have a support on the four hour chart at 10 cents. We do have the 618 at 09, and we do have the main support at 008. Eventually, though, I do think we are going to be retracing back to the 786. I personally, this is not financial advice, wouldn't be buying into math right now. Just judging by the past history, after every single one of these pumps, it retraces back to where it started and consolidates for a while. So if you missed this pump, I'm sorry to say, but you missed it. So I would try to play the next one and wait for this to retrace back down, consolidate, and then go for the next run up. So as of right now, I think math is going to start that slow slow downwards movement consolidation until we get the juice to have our next pump. So on the way back down, we're going to be stopping by the 618 most likely at around 9.2. Test that resistance, then head down to the 786, test that, and then eventually just consolidate until we take off once again. So I'm going to be bearish on math in the longer term, but we're going to keep a close eye on this because this repeats very, very often. It might not be a bad play to keep a close eye on this until we get um, until we see some indicators saying, hey, that large pumps could be coming here pretty soon, and then maybe we can make a really good flip play on it. But as of right now for math, I think we're just going to do that um, slow retrace and then long-term consolidation until we get the juice to do that next pump up. So with that, none of this is financial advice. And if there's any coins you'd like me to chart, or if you'd just like to chat with me, you can join my Discord channel. The link is below in the description.